Hi everyone, it's Connie again, back from Art in the Find. I'm here today, and welcome to my bathroom, to share with you a little about hand-washing wool sweaters. Cashmere and polyester, too. So I learned the hard way by going to the dry cleaner and spending a lot of money because I thought that was a more uh, safe option in washing my sweaters, but what I've come to find is that hand-washing is gentle, easy, and if you do it the right way, your wool sweaters will be well cared for. So all you need is a sink, some gentle cleanser. I chose wool light. It's around ten or twelve dollars at the sh at the store, and you fill the sink halfway with what's called tepid water. So not too hot, not too cold, just somewhere right in between, almost lukewarm. Fill that halfway. Then you want a cap, probably about halfway full, filled with the gentle cleanser. You want to dump in and swish around a little bit. Then take your loved wool sweater. Make sure that you turn it inside out. That's the best way when washing. And stick it in the sink. You don't want to wring, you don't want to squeeze. You just want to kind of wash it around a little bit. Leave it there, swish it, let the bubbles get nice and sudsy. And then you want to leave it for somewhere in between five to 10 minutes. Usually the stains will come out between that time so you don't need to keep it in there any longer. Then you want to move the sweater to the side and the reason for that is because wool can be kind of tricky, and so you don't want to rinse it under the water directly. You want to let the sink out and fill it up with a little bit more tepid water, put the sweater back in, and rinse. You want to do that one more time. Now, when you're ready to dry, you want to gently kind of press the rest of the water out, take your wool sweater and a towel, and you want to do what's called a jelly roll. So you want to lay your sweater flat on the ground, but for the sake of still seeing me on camera, I thought I'd show you here. You want to lay your sweater out and gently roll it up to squeeze all that water out. Then, after doing that, you want to lay your sweater flat to dry. They say use a mesh rack, but I don't have one of those. So I use either a cookie rack or just a nice clean towel, and I lay it out and turn it over. You want to just lay it out gently because, again, wool can stretch really easily. But trust me, I've done this with my wool sweaters. I've done this with polyester and cashmere. And for under $12, you can do this with all your sweaters before you store them away for the winter or wear them over and over again. So I hope that tip helps. I hope you have more confidence when washing your wool sweaters. And come and see me at artinthefind.com for more style tips. Bye, guys.